Hey everybody, what's going on? Welcome back to more of Pixelmon Adventures. I may or may not have accidentally taken another screenshot because I pressed the wrong button again! Unfortunately, anyways, in the previous episode, we went on a mining adventure and we got a bunch of crap and this is really, really confusing and... Ugh, no! Oh, look at my big face! Look at my big face! Look at, look at my face! My face! My face! I'm gonna slap you in the face! <laughs> okay, no, uh, that's the wrong button. There, there we go. <laughs> Alright, so anyways, in the last episode, we went mining. We got a bunch of stuff. It's in this chest. I'm pretty sure I can organize. Aha! I can sort through the chest. Sort in rows. Or, that works. I have eight diamond. Pretty cool. I got a blueberry bush. We got we got all kinds of stuff actually. Got quite a few different things. That's pretty cool. In this episode, we're gonna be setting up our berry farm because I have three different berries. Um, apparently we can make a healing station. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? He's gonna die. That is so not fair. Oh, you escaped. Oh, thank God. Run away. Run away, run away, run away. Anyways, apparently we can make a healing station. I don't know how to... Aha! Here we go. Ooh, heal ball. We can make a healer. We just need some aluminum plates, an iron ingot, and one diamond. This will actually make things a lot easier. So I think we're going to make that. How do I get the plates? How do I get the plates? Uh... Oh my gosh, I figured out what we have to do. Okay, I need an anvil. Anvil. Oh, I feel like an idiot. Alright, I need to make the anvil. How do I get out of get get out of the inventory? There we go. I need to make an anvil. Alright. This is really stupid. And it kinda makes sense. Oh boy, okay. Um I also need a hammer. How the fuck do I make a hammer? How do I make a hammer? Hammer, 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 H-A-M-M-E-R, here we go. Okay, so kind of like a, okay, that's cool. I can make it from pretty much anything. I don't have, actually I do have wood. All right, we'll make a stone hammer. Cobblestone hammer, I got a hammer. Oh, you mother, why? Go away. Yes, get out of here, man. Okay, so, in order to get the aluminum plates, you have to have an anvil, a hammer, and you have to have the aluminum ingots. And what you do is you take the aluminum ingots and you put it on the anvil, and then we have to sit here and smack it until it's a plate. Um, not like that. That was wrong. No! Why? This fucking Pokemon won't leave me alone. Thank you. You killed my Pokemon. Congratulations. Oh, it's working! I see it! Oh my gosh! Okay, I see. I see, I see. This fucking Pokemon is driving me crazy. How do I know when it's done? Oh! It's done. It has to be. Oh my gosh, yes! Yes, I got an aluminum plate. That fucking... You are driving me. You! You! You are driving me fucking crazy. Okay, I'm gonna sit here and do some aluminum plate smacking here and I will see you guys when we have enough to make a healing station. Well, I've been working on the railroad. Alright guys, so I have all the necessary ingredients or materials to make a healing station. You just need one diamond, so let's put the diamond in the center. And you need four aluminum plates need one in each corner and then you need an iron ingot to fill in the rest of the crafting table and then we have our own healing station oh my gosh it was that simple and now i don't have to walk all the way across the country to um heal our dear little squirtle in our house still does not have a roof or anything and that fucking Luxario or whatever it's called, what are you, Luxio or whatever, is still running around like a little twerp. So, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and heal my Squirtle, even though it's kind of pointless because I know he's gonna die 
But it's okay because we can just heal him again because we have our own healing station. How freaking cool is that? That's pretty awesome if I do say so myself. That is a level 40 goal bat. Oh my god. No, no, no. Go in the house. Go in the house. Yeah, I'm in the house. I am in the house. Alright. So, we have two apricorn berries. Unfortunately, we need a lot of apricorn berries in order to uh, make pokeballs and all kinds of stuff. So, we're actually going to go ahead and plant these trees out here. And I'll probably go on a little adventure later on to get some more berries. Now eventually I would like to have a farm. However, I just kind of planted them out here for now. Uh, this is probably going to be our little garden area at some point in time. But right now it's just a freaking grassy land of whatever this is. So this is the beginning of our tree berry farm. These are radishes, yummy. So let's all keep that in mind. This is not permanent, it's just to get us started. In the meantime, however, I am going to go collect some more wood so that we can finish working on our house. I also need to go get some sand. Don't really, I guess technically there's some sand over here. Let me get a shovel and I'll arm myself up with some axes and I'll get all, get all ready. Oh, a black apricorn berry, a berry tree, yay. Oh, I'm stuck in the water! I need this marble. I do. I think we're gonna redecorate. I think I might want my floor made out of marble instead of the pink wood that we have going on. So I definitely want all this stuff. Also, I found some iron. How cool is that? Pretty freaking cool! Is this a cave? Oh, I found a cave! Or part of a cave. Ooh, I wonder how big it is. I found a cave and it's so big. So much marble, holy shit. It's actually really, it's actually pretty freaking big. I'm not gonna lie, there's, wow. Smelt my sand. Who are you, Izzy? You're level 23, go away. I don't want anything to do with you. Alright, so I laid down a couple of the marble blocks on the inside, and I don't hate it. Let me put up a couple torches so you guys can see. I know it's a little bit, it's a little dark in here. There you go, get some light up here. I don't hate it, but I'm not sure if I want a solid white floor. And if I change the floor to be white, then I was thinking... Maybe instead of doing that, I could just make the balcony white. You guys said it was too much pink anyways. This is the marble. That might look a little better, maybe? I don't know. I don't think marble really belongs on a balcony. I was thinking maybe we could start with the inside of this floor, and I don't know if I want to do, like, a pattern. So I was thinking if I just knock out the pink, it might look, might look okay. I don't know. Or I can knock out the opposite and do a pattern that way. But I don't like how it looks with the pink. Or I could just do it all white. I think the white might look nice. Oh, I have no design capabilities. Uh, uh, my designing abilities suck. They really do. They are really that bad. So, while I decide, I'm stuck on the chest, no I'm not, while I decide, I don't want that, I'm going to start on our windows. Alright, so I've decided that I'm going to do away with this floor and we're going to have a solid white marble floor. So I'm going to go ahead and pull this all out and replace it with marble because I think it will look better that way. Hopefully I have enough marble to work with though. Don't know if I'm gonna have enough. I think that looks, I think it looks nice. And what I was thinking I could do, what I was thinking is instead of having all this white floor, I could have pink carpet. Cause there's pink carpet, there's pink wool, 
Um, a eucalyptus door. I didn't realize you could make... Ooh, I could have a pink door. Yeah. Let's see, uh, we could just have, like, pink decor. Like, why is there two different pink carpets? I don't understand. Carpet block. Oh, it's a fancier carpet. Yeah, so I was thinking we could do, like, pink accents. That way, the pink isn't overwhelmingly pink. I was also thinking I would probably redo the balconies as well. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Perfect. I think that's really nice. And the pink door accent is absolutely adorable. Now I just have to do something with these balconies. I do believe I'm going to knock out the balconies and make them marble flooring as well. Just so that it'll match the inside. Again, we're going to do pink accents instead of full-on pink everything so we'll see how that turns out oh no that's not where that goes Ooh, i like this idea yay we're gonna have poles stripper but what the fuck it vanished a second ago i like it i approve Lori approves However, I don't have enough marble to do the other side of this balcony, but I do approve of this so far. So far, so good. We are doing relatively well. I like it. I like it, I like it, I like it. Oh crap. What the fuck are you doing in my house? What do you think you're doing? You need arena, I need arena, I need arena, I need arena. Get out of here, man. Get the freak out of here. Alright, so far, um, I've started on the second story, kind of. I got the floor. Oh my god, that is a giant Kangaskhan. Why is it so big? That's what she said. Why is that thing so huge? No, where did it go? It despawned. It disappeared. Where the fuck did it go? It was huge. What in the world? It's gone now. Oh, it's rotten flesh. Did you kill it? You ate each other? Ew. That's nasty. Anyways, <laughs> I've started on the second floor of the house. I added a layer of the cherry blossom wood around the top. Technically the center there. And I ran out of marble again. I found some more in a patch. But uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and put up the next layer of walls. Which should start right here should definitely start right here so I'm gonna be doing that real quick and then I'll lay the framework down for the next balcony but I don't have the necessary um, I don't have the necessary ugh, the whatchamacallit for the, the necessary uh, marble yeah the necessary marble for the balconies yet so I'm not gonna do those just yet, and I don't have the necessary marble put floor yet either, so I got to get that going on. Ow! Alright, so I didn't have enough wood to finish the second story of the house yet, which is fine. It's still it has still turned out quite nicely so far. I did have enough marble to finish the second balcony. Um, the second floor is coming along quite nicely. I've collected a couple different berry trees and we're going to be starting our tree berry tree farm soon. I also need to get our food farm under control because I haven't exactly started that. But uh, this is going to be a two-story a two-story house and that top row instead of it being white is going to actually have another layer of the sakura blossoms around it and then we're gonna do some kind of fancy roof pattern so we are getting somewhere at this point in time i really like the door i think this is gonna come uh cut back on the amount of pink that we use so that is also good and let's see oh it's raining what's that ekans 11 a little 16 ekans unfortunately that is all the time I have for this episode. I know it is a little short, however, there will be two episodes this week and it will be a little bit longer. Um, in the next episode, 
I don't know if I'm going to work on the house or not. I have yet to decide if I want to work on the house in the next episode or not. I think I'm going to focus on finding more berries and getting our farm in order so that we can harvest these uh, apricorn berries on a regular basis so that we can make some pokeballs so that we can catch pokemon so i think in the next episode we're going to start focusing on catching some pokemon so if you guys would like to support me and if you guys would like to see more of uh, pixelmon adventures please show your support by leaving a like and a comment in this section below both of those things really do help me out a lot and i really do appreciate it and yeah leave a like leave a like for squirtle look Squirtle says he loves you all so very, very much. So leave a like for Squirtle, and I will see you guys very soon with more of Pixelmon Adventures. Bye, guys!